Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Tomb Raider with Tears of Gaia. Look at the radio tower over there. Looks like we have to get up there and then cast an SOS signal. We got... We got the... Uh, I don't know. The signal from Roth. All we gotta do is make the climb. Which he can't because he's injured. But it's time for some more exposition via the camp. I'm telling you, Reyes, it's mechanical, not an electrical problem. Now, Alex. <coughs> this looks like it might be a, an electrical problem. You think? <coughs> oh, hello. Hey. Is this little fox, huh? Oh, yeah. He's cute, huh? <laughs> yeah, cute, hey, it's yeah. Alicia. Alicia. It's my like daughter. That. Oh. Fourteen years old, and smarter than you'll ever be. She must must get that from her father. Don't give him the attention. And yeah. I'll take a look at this. <laughs> Probably electrical. From her father. So I was on the walk, right? Doing a spot of midnight fishing. Hey, Grim, time to button down the hatches. I'd be right with you. So I was on the walk, right? And this thing comes looming at me, looming out of the water it was. So I give it a real Glasgow kiss, you know. <laughs> Get shot of trouble nine times out of ten, that does. <laughs> Took me a week to sleep that night off, and I've not touched a drop since. See you at dinner, Sam. Ooh. All right. Can we take B-roll, please? Thank you. Dr. James Whitman, filler 15, take three, and action. Okay. Now, take a firm grip, and then slice him down the belly, like this. Yeah, you got... Cut! 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 Uh, is, is he coming back? Dr. James? <sighs> I'll go get him. <laughs> renowned archaeologist. I discovered the world renowned archaeologist, fish, Mr. Dr. James Whitman. It's just a fish. It's, it's fine. Know, it's just You're going to be fine. <laughs> this damned reality TV business. I'm, I'm meant to be bringing culture to the people, Sam, not dinner. Uh, no offense, Jonah. The audience demands content, Dr. Whitman. You know that. So until we find the Lost Kingdom, we need footage like this. Come on, let's just take it from the top, okay? We're gonna make you look like Gordon Ramsay in editing. Dr. James Whitman, filler 15, take four, action. Okay, now take a firm grip, and then slice him down the belly, like that. I've studied them so much, I can see charts on the back of my eyelids. But if I'm not right about Yamatai being in the Dragon's Triangle... I remember when you found that one of your father's digs. You ran up and showed it to me dressed in your penguin pajamas. <laughs> I was five <laughs> years old. It was my first find. Yeah. You've got great instincts, girl. You just have to trust them. Mm. That's what my father used to say. Now, there was a man that ran on instinct. For better or worse. He would have been so proud of you, Lara. We're getting closer to the storm. Well, whatever's coming, we'll get through it, eh? <laughs> okay, Lara. Pull yourself together. They're counting on you. This coin probably found its way into Japanese circulation sometime in the mid-19th century. Didn't even get the chance to talk about what we, what we just learned. Because I found that coin here. Uh, well, there's nothing to find. Um, What did we learn, though? They were on some kind of reality TV show kind of business. 
I didn't know about that. I would never have thought that. This. Bad feeling about what? This corner here? Because you can't get up there. <laughs> okay. I have a bad feeling about this as well. Well, let's. Now you, my friend, first the lamp. Oh, damn it. Mm, burned out again. Surprised they even work after so many years. You are my first victim. Then you. Then you. Okay. That was all of them. To me, it seems like if there's no one that raises the alarm and that guy over there won't even shoot me he just won't what are the dudes that I just killed hello I know that I shot someone back here there he is okay now that was easier than my first few tries <laughs> Of course, there's gonna be someone working back here as well. Oh, bad idea to be working here. Really bad idea. Oh. Could have sworn there was something blinking there that I wanted to pick up. What? I need help. Time to die. Time to die. Oh, oh, my friend, you don't stand a chance. Okay, but where are the others? I know that. How many are there? And it's a girl. I oh, know it's a woman. Why is it a girl? They're coming down. Okay, so now that they know that I'm here, I can also use my pistol. Question is, do they really know I'm here? Oh yeah. That, that guy over there seems to know that I'm here. That would have been so swell. That shot. Thank you. Okay, so stuff just got really intense. <laughs> That's why I'm so quiet. <laughs> I don't want to die again. Don't you think I hear you? Hey, he should burst into flames. He has some kind of gasoline tank or what? Oh, yeah, of course. He's gonna burn when I give him a headshot. That's totally what happens. If someone shoots you in the head, you're gonna explode, of course. Oh, okay, okay. Not gonna talk about that. I'm just gonna go back here and there's gonna be treasure. Just some salvage, I guess. So I have no idea where we are on the map. Maybe we should check it out. Oh, pretty close. We're pretty close. 40% complete, it says. I guess. World War II era. Probably Japanese. Yeah, it's gotta be. It was where Private Kosuke is. Was. Holy shit. Was I supposed to fall in here? <laughs> Plus one skill point. Come on. Get your shit together, Lara. For 
better or worse, I now follow Father Matthias. If I'm gonna be stuck on his island, at least I have the best possible job. He calls me his first salary. Matthias might be insane, but he's smart and dangerous. He knows things about this island. I believe is our only chance of ever getting out of here. Matthias keeps us happy. We control the guns and the food. Anything the storm brings to this island is ours, and we decide the fate of any new survivors. Any who defy us are killed. We are masters of this fucked up prison. Okay, yeah, that's... That's totally how I portrayed them, you know, their, their identity. How they identify themselves as prisoners. They're gonna stop at nothing to control this place. No one leaves. And I'm pretty sure... Oh, there's something down there. Embrace the flames. Oh, well, I don't really like that. <laughs> flames are not my friend. Haven't been until now. Oh yeah, load it with load it with fuel. No shit. What do they need it for? <laughs> Heavy leg damage. Didn't work. I damaged your leg. Now I can shoot your head in peace. Great. Okay. That was easy. They specifically told me to shoot the barrel. <laughs> that's that's what I got out of it. Now I gotta take a look around for some. I don't know. There's gotta be a new challenge that I didn't unlock until now. Oh, like, like in here. Just a salvage, okay. But still, salvage is good, you know. I like salvage. What's in a toilet? Can't open it. But it's okay, you know. Probably don't want to see what's inside of this toilet. Just saying. Ah, uh, can't pick it up, okay. And what's in here? Oh, I could burn this. That's the challenge, alright. I'm gonna sneak back here. Light up my torch. Because apparently I'm gonna need it to... Burn shit down. Embrace the flames. You know what I'm gonna tell you? Embrace this. Embrace this flame. Non-believer. Yeah, I'm a non-believer. I'm a firm non-believer in your Solari business. I'm gonna destroy all your banners for that reason. Can't get in here. <laughs> sure about that? <laughs> Just a firm headshot will end all this business once and for all. So, you know, you don't get confused about who's who, who's the boss and who's not. No one leaves. Wait a minute, there's another banner. Destroy it as well. What else? What else could there be? So I know what to do. We gotta have to throw a lantern over there. First, check out what's here before we burn all it down. Get rid of the gas here. Oh, whoa! What the hell? What a psycho. Okay, I just opened the gauge. I thought I closed it. Lara, what the hell are you doing? Gonna get yourself killed. But now it's gonna be even more fun to throw the lantern over there. <laughs> oh my friend. 
Okay, okay. Oh, now, now, I, now, now, I, now I get it. What, what kind of door that is? Oh, I'm gonna need a lot. I'm coming for you. Coming for you, my friend. But actually, I was hoping for another lantern because there's a banner. It's not easy. Those challenges sometimes are really challenging. Oh, a submachine gun. Awesome. Just in. Please. Go to hell. Yeah. That's what you get. Expedition field report. Despite loss of two cargo ships to intense storms, the expedition has made landfall. We've established a communication center high in the mountains, and coastal base construction has commenced. Initial surveys have revealed several possible excavation sites. The island is much larger than we originally anticipated, and layered with many centuries of history. The task of identifying the source of the storms will be long and arduous. But if we succeed in our mission here, our victory in this war will be certain. So, history lesson. Japan was was part of the Axis powers, so that's why a German guy wrote this when they came here to study this project. Somehow they were hoping to find a secret that would help them win the war. Yeah, that's what he just said. I don't have to explain it to you, I know. What I need is fire. Now, oh. I don't know what I don't need. Come on, guys. Seriously? Where's the rest of them? Didn't I just shoot your head? Freak. Didn't I just roll out of the way? Okay. How many headshots does she have to deal? To dish out? Oh my gentle Jesus. <laughs> this is so intense. This is really awesome. So some of the moments here are just so intense. There would have been a barrel back here, but of course... Of course I didn't find it, because of Father course... Father Matthias will set us free. From what? This island? Good question, Lara. Another good question is, really, I'm so... There's fire, really, I have to go... That was a neck shot, basically, but yeah. I'm gonna take it. Okay, well, let's backtrack and burn all the banners, because we know what to do. Embrace the flames. Embrace the flames banner, number one. Number three. Now I know where number four is. And that would be one challenge completed. Yay! Are you gonna pick it back up, the torch? Yeah, okay. Great. I just wanted to say. There is it. There's gonna be someone telling me what I missed. I know it. As always, this one person. And I can see it. There it is. So I have my set of the GPS caches complete. There's gonna be another banner back here somewhere. It's 
gotta be. Map room. There it is. Last one. Challenge complete. I actually never heard that jingle before. <laughs> Can you believe that? I suck at challenges. Now we completed one and it really feels great. Like an achievement. Well, let's get in the control room. Okay. <laughs> You're not going to be able to use that. Alex, are you there? Yeah. The console's a wreck. Damn it. Well, unless you see a radio shack around, you're going to have to patch it manually through the maintenance panel. Okay. That sounds simple enough. Yeah, well, uh... You're gonna have to find it first. On those old towers, they installed those panels high up. I mean, way high up. Oh, great. Climbing again. Great. At least we know where to go. Isn't that right, Lara? Isn't that right? I am alone now. The rest of them are dead. This is for the best. I watched from the cliffs as their makeshift boat was tossed and turned by the storms. The clouds look like a hand upon the water, desperately clawing at their doomed boat. None survived the wrath of the storm. I observed it carefully. The storm was localized and sudden, and just as suddenly, it was gone. And this is the most interesting detail. It didn't seem random. I sensed emotion, something deliberate. I don't know what's happening on this island, not yet. But if I ever hope to escape, I must understand this phenomenon. Now my real work begins. Seems like we could learn a whole lot of this Matthias fellow. About being crazy and shit. Let's get out there. Oh. It hurt her. Fumes? Pretty deadly, it seems. Oh. <laughs> Well, you know, Laura, that. Whoa! There seems to be a lot still intact here. So I'm guessing. Yay! Isn't that gorgeous? You think so? Well, there's a camp. I'm gonna rest here, spend a skill point, and then continue next time. But wait a minute. A skill point. Oh, brawler upgrades. Awesome. What do I wanna invest in? No, can't. Survivor? I'm gonna invest in a uh, bone collector. Animal corpses? No, wait a minute. Yeah, extra salvage from crates. That's better. Don't really kill animals a lot, so... What about the gear? Can I upgrade something? I can... Upgrade reinforced limbs, allow a stronger pull for increased damage. Great. I really love the bow, so I'm gonna invest a whole lot in the bow. 
Okay, okay guys. That's where we're gonna end this episode. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Next time we're gonna climb up that beautiful tower over there and then hopefully get rescued. Or let's hope not. <laughs> then everything will be over. If you like this episode, you know what to do. Give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you don't want to miss out on the next one. And I hope to see you then.